Hey, hey. How's everybody doing? I'm just going to get on and do some uh, Apache flying today. Hope everybody's well. Tidy Tibbs, welcome. Thanks for dropping by. Yeah, I got, uh, I think I got my front seat controls configured. So, um, I'm going to get on and uh, do some, uh, well, I got it set up for flat screen. So, I got my track IR on just in case I need to actually fly the thing if George decides he wants to be a pain. I can take control and just fly it, but yeah, so I was going to get on the contention server. I think I think they're running the 80s campaign right now. I'm not sure. Let's see. Let's see what they got. Contention. Oh, no, they're still running the 90s. Perfect. 8 o'clock in the morning. That's a good time. It's not dark. So, all right. So, let's go ahead and start that up. So, I'm using the, uh... Oh, jeez. What the hell happened here? All right. Didn't need all that. Um, I have the track IR clip pro thing somewhere. <laughs> I have it. Um, I just, I don't know. I, I don't wear traditional headset. I've got, uh, ear monitors, audio monitors that I use now. So. I don't really have anything to clip it to. And uh, honestly, I mean, this works pretty well. So I'm just going to stick with this for now. Uh, we'll see. If I get ambitious, maybe I'll pick up the Track Clip Pro at some point. But not going to do it now. Oh, that's not good. Let's, um, all right. So it looks like I can get in here. All right, won't let me in a tactical commander spot, but I can get in a JTAC spot, which is good because now I can look at the map and see what's going on, where everything is, and uh, where I should spawn in. So, uh, let's see. I'm going to do something. Try to make this good for everybody. Oh, ad break. Good. We'll let it. We'll let that run while I'm trying to figure things out. <laughs> um. Why? Oh, this is some kind of a bullshit they're doing on the server right now. It does not... Oh, there we go. Alright. Maybe now I can watch YouTube chat, too. We'll see. Okay. So, there's a bunch of... Man, they are just... There's not much blue left out here. See where we can spawn. It's gonna have to be over here. So the idea is to capture farps. Capture. Uh, I guess I'm talking while the ad breaks are running, but um, the idea is to capture uh, territory. So let's see. Drone up. They got these guys out here. What is this? Can I spawn in here? Park 12. Let's see. 
Looks like they're coming after it. I don't know if I can actually spawn into those. Okay, mark 12. says we don't own that. Did I pick the wrong number? Problem. All right, let's go back and look again. It says we don't own it. Probably because there's no friendly forces there, so... I have to spawn it somewhere else. Jeez. This is going to be kind of a long flight. This is Hate. Yeah. That's what I've been doing. Thanks, Pale. Welcome. Hate. You're not on government time, are you? <laughs> All right, let's see. This this already looks like this battle's pretty much over, but we'll try. See if we can. Ete, uh, ete. Here we go. Currently locked. Do this one. Do that one. Ah, I gotta start it up. Let everything render in real quick. All right. Hopefully all my sound is coming through. I think it is. Thank you. So what's the plan? I was missing some sounds yesterday. Good one. Morning after your left. It seems like everything up to the Yeah, but we were playing all day long today. There was nobody to do for us. No sounds are coming through. Let's go now. Let's just go ahead and get this. Oh, we can still defend it, I think. And then bring it back. Get everything else ready. You gotta do that. Just we need more people to log in and we'll start to get the second. Forget I don't have to turn my head as far. Five against eighteen. <laughs> just bring all the men on this. Stop them from this. I'm just going super it's high. It's gonna be hard for me to sneak out of here. It looks like there's a whole bunch of stuff in there. Mm. Perfect scenario for F14 right now. Um, alright, this is gonna be my video page. Yeah, yeah, it, uh, it looks amazing. Like in, in VR, it actually feels like you're sitting in the cockpit. It's, it's so wild. Um, shoot, I'm going ahead. Take an FCR? 
guess it can't hurt. Shot down that MQ9, so that's good. Uh, what was it? Gun set to ten missiles. Join. Blue's hurting. Blue is uh, in a bad way right now. stuff. It's, it, there's usually a little bit of a tent there too. Uh, can't really, can't really tell it's there. Uh, this must be like a block two or a lot. Yeah, so it's uh, it's a lot. It's right when, right after the uh, TDAC, the addition of the TDAC and the MTADs. Version. So that would have been uh, block two, lot eight software, I think, uh, which is what my unit was getting ready to convert to when uh, I left active duty for five. So, uh, let me see. dude, awesome! Thanks for the raid. Tricker, yeah, man, that'd be awesome. Um, definitely, we'll have to set something up. That'd be fun. Um, yeah, welcome. 
Welcome everybody. That's awesome. I appreciate you dropping by and checking this out. I'm going to try to jump in the front seat and uh, see if I can figure it out because uh, I have not done any front seat work in a long time. So. Oh, that's awesome, man. I appreciate that. Yeah. Any, uh, any time I can, uh, I can do anything to help uh, people understand this aircraft a little bit. I don't understand it completely either. I mean, there's, there's a lot of shit. It's complicated, but, uh, yeah, at least I've got a little bit of time and knowledge. Coolio, I'm out here uh, about uh, 10 o'clock. i got the air-to-air -air missiles that'll be following you around today. Nice. Got my own escort. Where are you going to attack? Um, I'm going to work my way... Uh, it looks like FARC-12. So, uh, yeah. Somewhere vicinity FARC-12, and then eventually moving towards Aleppo. That's the plan. We'll see how it works out. Nice. Yeah. Good times. All right. Show pages. Sorry, I'm still getting all this stuff set up. Controls are. No, not that. That one? Yes, there we are. I gotta move that out of the way. See, this is the hard thing is. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Red player Xi Jinping died. Uh, get up. Sorry, was that on stream? that up in HMD so that I can fly. I'm going to try doing some flying from the front seat. Oh, definitely, man. Marksy, appreciate it. That's awesome. Thanks for the raid. Thanks uh, for, uh, for dropping by and uh, get some rest. Alright. I think we got everything we need. I didn't put in a way. I should, I should put a point for FARC 12. Real quick. It'll only take a minute. Wait till the last minute. It only takes a minute. Alright. Point. Just gonna add this one. And then we will be ready to go. Let's just make it a target. That makes it easy. Enter. Free text. Oh, 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 we're taking fire. Somebody just blew up next to me. Tricker. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, Sierra Bravo. I'm going to get blown up while I'm sitting here on the ground. 9917. Appreciate it, Marksy, and uh, anytime. Thanks again for dropping by and for the raid. All right. Uh, let me just take. A... Oh, they got an external view disabled. Never mind. I can't see if I'm damaged. I don't think I am because I didn't get a master caution or anything. So let's get out of here before they do any damages. All right, clear left, right.
There we go. Had to hit C to take control. Oh, shoot. Now let's go. Come on, I reset in the back. What server? Uh, I'm on the contention uh, 90s campaign server. Oh, because I switched from the front to the back. That's what happened. Let's go. Uh, I don't fly in 2D, so this is fun. Uh, generally, we're going to be going to the east, I think. Yeah, east. I got them all. It's definitely a different sight. Picture flying in the front seat. Fall the smoke. Yeah. Yeah, that's probably a good plan. Uh, routes. No. Yeah. Direct. Point. I tell you, you probably shouldn't uh, text and drive. I, I think this is worse. I'm trying to fly with my left hand. Is that right? Yeah, I'm going south. That's right. So we're going this way. Where we need to go this way. We need to go east. Alright. Why is my radar altimeter not working? Let me guess. It's not automatically enabled in the front seat. Or did I get damaged or something? <laughs> I don't know. Let it go, boys. We gotta bring it back. Some Atlanta, some I remember. This screen, I got two over there, I got the iPad over here. <laughs> um, and then, you know, the three actual screens. Yeah, I don't know, I don't have a radar altimeter. This is, uh, I'm not quite sure what happened here. All right, we're moving to the back seat to fly because flying the front seat sucks. <laughs> get George up to at least help us in the short term. Here's our home plate. 27 clicks. Come on, yeah, come on. 20, 25 minutes. I better make it. Take Name forever to get out there. Like, uh, CC taxi and rolling to roll. Let's do this. Fence it. I'm going to take the gun. Sorry, George. You can have a missile cell. And... Yeah, it, it, it definitely is. Um, and having a human front seater is... It's definitely more fun as well. You don't see things as easily, because George, you know, just like the AI, George can freaking pick things and up. You're slightly outnumbered, Blue. Um, find them and be able to yeah. engage them. You know, very easily. Whereas, <laughs> you know, I gotta search. It's truly on the outside your I just defended so well. Got you inside. Oh fucking 
four west of the third. My radar altimeter went uh, Tango Uniform, I think, in that uh, uh, bombing at the airfield, so uh, I'm just flying low. You're coming in unreadable like the mic across the room. I'm sure you got plenty going on, so I wouldn't worry about <coughs> fixing up unless you know what it is. Right. No, I was just saying my radar altimeter's in up. Okay, oh, Roger, I can pick you up there. You want me to fix that when we get back? <laughs> uh, yes, sir. Just your radar altimeter, can you take a look at it? Yeah, I think it got damaged when the airfield got bombed there. Um, uh. that's a gazelle. Pale Riders, uh, driving a gazelle. So he's got some, uh, some missiles ready to help defend. So, what that means is that without a radar altimeter, I don't have any, uh, altitude hold. Yeah, see, it doesn't know. I guess it would hold. Yeah, I guess it would. I don't know. You would think it wouldn't, but uh, it turned on, so maybe it does. Yeah, let's see. Yeah, he moved off. SU-25, five nautical miles, hot. Zero two five. Roger, I'm gonna get low. Try not to hit any trees. So, uh, for you guys that, uh, that are watching on YouTube, uh, I have to look over here to look at my YouTube chat, so, uh, forgive me if I'm a little slow in responding. The, uh, Twitch chat. I'm waiting for somebody to make a YouTube Twitch chat. Twitch, 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 Buck two. Got a mo block. Buck. Flash one hind. Back in the uh, trail with you, buddy. It's just how we do. Nice. All right. It took two heaters to get that big bull down. Yeah, I bet. Hill Rider with the air to air kill. Let's see. Let me see if it'll do an altitude hold here. Let's do a trim, attitude, altitude. It looks like it's going to hold it. Uh, poles, poles, get up. <laughs> Get down. Uh, you want to one? You're getting chased by two rockets. Was that for me? Uh oh. Whoever's in the one on one, called the call. Yeah, yeah. Whereabouts, mate? There's three of them. Hopefully, like, we're low yeah, enough that those missiles are not for us. Yeah, I guess I need to get George looking out here. I'm coming as fast as possible. I am not used to flying in 2D. Oof. See? Brought my head back too fast. Got 
I got something uh, in the air in front of me just over the top of the hill. Yep, Tally. I think it's an SU-25, the way it's slow lumbering or a helo. Doesn't look like George has picked it up. I see it. George should be able to see it. Yeah, George isn't able to pick it up, so I don't know what it is. I'm gonna push up. I'm a little faster than you, and I gotta get closer to kill stuff, so I'll go ahead and push up and start scouting as we press this battle up. Roger. Oh wait, no, he did pick it up. It's K-50. George identified it as a K-A-50. Oh, Roger. K-A. I guess I should pay better attention. I forgot where exactly <laughs> that, uh, that list shows up. Are you gonna engage or bypass? I'm gonna attempt to bypass, um... Just because I don't have the right armament for him. Roger, all. I'm going to double back. I got great air to air. I'm going to bypass the protect. Roger. Right. We'll, uh. Um. Anyway, I'm going to try to not necessarily stay all the way in the low ground, but not silhouette myself by cresting this saddle here. I think we still got... No, we still got a long way to go. I can pick it up a little bit. They're wrecking our people. Let's look at the map real quick. Yeah, we see we're just, just coming into view now. So. Okay. They're not shooting at me. I don't think they are. I just didn't want to go over the top of that. It just makes it that much easier for bad guys to see you. Tricker got one. Awesome. I think the auto mod doesn't like the uh, the all caps. I'm pretty sure that's what it is. Stupid bots. I don't know. I see it though. It showed up in the stream. I don't know. I get, it shows it up there. Alright, Scully, I'm long six of you. I'm gonna start keeping right out your uh, three o'clock. I wanna come in the south. Okay, uh, this is still showing us uh, about 14 clicks out from the center of the farm, so um, I think the outer ring is a 
I don't know, a couple clicks. So we'll be getting in there uh, pretty close. I'll be slowing down probably in about, uh, I don't know, five or six clicks. Roger on. Of course, I talked all that smack about not silhouetting myself and, you know, coming in over the tops of hills. And here we go, coming in over the top of the hill. I got, we got a helo right to the left, uh, 12 o'clock. I'll go ahead and engage with it. Just get closer, come. Oh, tally. Fuck. Got a hook with the back. Good hit. Fuck. He's coming in on. I think we're good. Flash. Is he down? Yeah, he's down. Did you make it out clean? Yes, sir. All right, good news is, two dead helos, bad news is I'm out of uh, missiles. Uh, no worries. We just got our good looks to rely on now. Well, I won't talk bad about the French helicopter because it, it did us good. You gotta do what you gotta do. That's right. All right. I think it's time to start. Ooh, another helicopter. One o'clock. Tally. I'm gonna try oh, to engage with gun. Shit, he's gonna gonna get above me. Is he down? Very nice. Nice. I've over torqued the shit out of it, but uh, it's all right. I'm alive. <laughs> I'll take a look at it when we look at your radar. There we go. It's just a just a write up, right? Oh, there's a. Uh, I just flew through some orange smoke. No, I they don't. Us. Front? Nobody. Not yet. Uh, my plan was to be in the front. Uh, okay, so there is some stuff out there. Hey, you're starting up in an Rifle far 12. Shit, missed. Target's identified, shot out on a truck. Rifle, okay, far close. and a Euro on the southwest side of the airfield, marked with red smoke. If anyone wants to take it out. SA-13. Way too close. I didn't realize we were three clicks away. All right, let's move. I'm gonna move back to the uh, west, set up behind a hill, and then uh, try to engage from a hover. Rod. I got troops 
a Vulcan on board, so I'm just going to continue to drop Artie every minute until we take the point uh, neutral, and then I'll drop. <laughs> Ramming speed! It wasn't a tree. That was a K-50. <laughs> All right. Let's, uh... Let's see if we can get back in. I don't think I've ever died in a midair in this game, so that's a that's a new one for me. All right, thanks, Pale Man. That was awesome. That was that was some great air cover. Um, I died in a midair, so. But at least they died too. Friendly Hornet coming in south of Ate. Watch your fire ground forces. select everything and then you know if it gets to be too much I'll turn things off but otherwise it's fine to just turn it all on and see how it goes all right so we have the right gas we have the right weapons yes just waiting on the I am used to align You got to do it all. You got to get everything set. You don't have to do the, uh, like if you're doing the front seat only, you don't have to do like the TADS internal bore sight. They didn't do that. They didn't set that up. Um, or the out front bore sight for that matter. Box um, three bandit. Which you would that. normally do uh, if you're flying an Apache. Um, you bore sight the TADS. It's got an internal bore sight. And then if you're going to use a weapon, which you always do every flight. And then you do an out front bore sight if you're going to use weapons. So. Watch uh, one two twenty five. Let's see. Go ahead. Where's the like? I don't know. I think it's just the thumb. Gauging up to. I'm not sure. It depends on the. Depends on how you're watching. I'm not sure. Uh, it's good though. It's uh, it's a lot of fun. I gotta look up here real quick. All right. Okay, let's try. I got two to fly. I a game crash, sorry, Jen. Uh, let's get this back up. I still don't have any news. Alright, 
PTSD, I got COVID. I think I got everything set up the way I want. set up the front seat in case I do actually get to use it. Shit, we're taking... How are we getting... Who's shooting at us? Alright, let's get out of here. Hey, in case any of you haven't noticed, uh, there are tanks at Hawkeye. Oh, shoot, I didn't. Yeah, they're far... Yeah, I, I saw we got hit by something. Alright, let's see. What's here? No, we I'll need uh, EWR up. Uh, back to the back here. seat, because it's just easier right now. Since we are not in a safe location. I'll get one up as soon as I'm done with these tanks. Are the tanks vicinity hey Tay? I just took off from uh, Heite. It's Ocean 1-1. One one. Just took off from Heite. I'm on an A-64. Uh, I started taking some ground fire before I took off. I'm looking for where the uh, where those guys are sitting. Okay, pick him up. No, that's a gazelle. Friendly gazelle. for the follow. I see a hostile vehicle on the uh, runway. I think. Yeah, no shit. Oh. Well, someone should do something about that. What do you think I'm trying to do right now? So not used to doing this in 2D. This is killing me. Get a little bit of standoff. See if we can come back around and take him out. Box three bandit on the deck hot. That's me. Don't want to get too slow. No. Ugh. I don't have enough. I'm too heavy. Uh, yeah, I don't want to ditch my stories. Alright. 
let's hop out, hop in another one. It's gonna keep up like this, I'm just gonna get back in the, uh, I didn't realize it was that bad. I'm just gonna get in the VR, because I don't fly well like this. <laughs> I'm hoping it doesn't spawn Somebody right, spawn up your army. In, uh, right in front of the bad guys. Shit. That doesn't sound good. We'll try this again. John, what's going on? Come to watch me die? <laughs> Shit. And there it is. Yeah. Right engine's not gonna start. This 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 is pointless. <laughs> delay timer but if I can't start the uh, number two engine then I'm not getting any sort of rise in NG so he's right behind the spawn of course he is of course he is ah Well, he's going to get for a surprise. We don't have picture. I'm gonna see if I can just we are spin around. Yeah, stop whining and fucking found one. Shoot him. Yeah, I, I, I like to find you know. I cry a lot. Trigger T80 marked on map. Yeah. Let me the AP on just for him. That's terrible. He's sitting right behind the spawn, then uh, definitely not going to work. And it is way too far. Hmm. Yeah, that is a long flight. How much points do we need for Alex? 58 miles. We'll take me. We have a exactly. Do not call an E3, it'll get shot at this guy right away. Uh, okay. Well, 
like I shot it. at someone near uh Game's over. South of All right. Hey, hey. Tell you what. Then I guess it is I'm the best to fly in this very uh, short post and soon to make them to come Just to us. long enough to um uh load into VR because this is pissing me off. I I did not want to uh I wanted to fly some damn front seat. And there's three choppers coming to our base. Yeah. You know what? Oh shoot, that's not letting me do anything. Yeah, they restarted the server. Alright. Um I'm trying to decide if I wanna change to VR or not, actually. I do, but I, I really want to fly some front seat. Uh, well, John? We've been trying to do it for, for a bit. Um, if you want to jump in, we can do it. <laughs> uh, give me a second here. I'm trying to decide which server. Man, I don't. Do I want to do gray flag? I don't know. What do you guys think? Which server? Or do you have a particular server that uh, that is your favorite? I typically hang out in the... Uh, if I'm not in one of the Wolfpack servers, and there's not much going on right now because it's the middle of the day, um, then I will try to do gray flag. Contention is new. Um, yeah, gray flag works. Persian Gulf or Syria? Bad IC. You know, I got that um, with the contention server the first time I tried to log in. I had to go in and disable a... Uh, what was it? It was a high-digit SAM file. And it was just one file. And once I just changed the name of that file, it worked fine. So, I don't know. It's kind of odd. But, um, this is the way. One-man army. <laughs> yeah, well, you know, I mean, you're not technically alone, right? You got George. I wouldn't call him a man, but Yes, that's it. That's the same file. I just renamed it, like added a .old at the end of it, and that fixed it. It passed an IC after that. Um... <laughs> now, now. Casmo and I get along. <laughs> Yeah, um, George. George is not a man. George is a, apparently all seeing but very incapable. Uh, what, what would you call that? Maybe a, I guess you could kind of call it a sentient being, but not really. I don't know. <laughs> all right. Um, I'll go ahead and load in, uh, yeah, Persian Gulf works. Let's go ahead and get that one going. Uh-oh. Yeah. 
DCS. What happened to DCS? Uh, did it? That's not showing up on the stream either. All right. Maybe that's just while it's loading. I'll give it a minute. My own, there it goes. All right. Well, I was hoping that would be a little more fun, but it was, uh, it started out fun. I mean, we had an escort, get, escort was getting air to air kills. Um, we got an air to air kill with the gun. That's, that was pretty awesome. Uh, it's the um, uh, gray flag, Persian Gulf. But um, they just had a lot of guys rolling in. Um, combined arms, you know, rolling in the, on the ground side and... Uh, <clears throat> Taking the places that uh, that we were apparently left to fend for themselves. So, oh well. Hello, darling. Hey, hey, can you hear me? Yeah, although it sounds like your mic for the game is like a room mic. Alright, let me, uh, let me adjust that real quick. <laughs> yeah, you Huh. How now, brown cow? Oh my god, that's so much better. Okay. I'm not sure what it was using for the, uh, the microphone. It, it's set to default, but, uh, it wasn't using my default, so... I don't know, my default oh. got all screwed up the other day. Maybe your webcam has a built one one built in or something? No I don't you know what? I think it I think it's the uh the controller that I use for the uh T DAG. It's a PlayStation controller. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, George is generally okay. Um, it's just... Like... So, for me, I was trying to do too many things differently. I'm trying to fly in 2D from the front seat. And trying to manage... I don't know. Joy ride, is that you There's to just too much going on. That uh, that I was not adequately prepared for, so it's all good. Yeah, this is your ride, uh, Roger. I have no communications with the uh, carrier. I'm checking my keybinds. Yeah, you keep transmitting right. to the this carrier. This should be on hack on, so I, did, I think it's a binding issue. Last, you did a little garbled at the end. Uh, day. Go ahead. 
think that's good enough. Yeah, sheepdog, repeat last. Go right over. Oh, see, look at this. It does show the uh, the buttons. Yeah, somebody uh, walked over you. I don't even remember how to do that procedure. I, I anymore. check your it's binding. Such a long you're time. transmitting to the carry on TACOM, so I think you just put something wrong. Uh, let's see. Yep, Roger that. Checking bindings. Guy on the uh, TACOM sounds like he's like a proper New York guy or something. Um, yeah, I can. I just I gotta go broadside for these mappers so I can make it effective. Uh, trying to reach the controls. There we go. Whew. Couldn't reach all the way down there, so I got the Apache Collective and I'm trying to hit the enter button. To hit that. Right, sir. Uh, where do you think about going? And I haven't even had a chance to look at the map yet. <laughs> I don't know. What do you recommend? Uh, Let's do a last check. God. All right. Twelve hellfires. Ooh, B is very busy. West Village. And East MSR. There's a Famuka North. Check on Boxer, cop check. Okay, that works. So 555 on Tech on. Do you want me to get the uh, points in? Um, I can get them in. Sure. Just give me, uh, give me Thanks, one guys. second here. I uh, can confirm it was my bindings. Com switch, com one, com two, radio, call radio menu. Thank you very much, guys. Is that New York or is that Boston? Uh, sound more New York to me. All right, I don't know why I'm doing this on two different pages, but oh, we're still waiting on INEs to align anyway, so we got time. We are down here. Right, I've loaded a bunch of hellfires on here. Are going over those points. Lamazon, East Village, West Village, East MSR. Okay. Where? Bleaker, welcome. All right, let me look. Here we go. No. Here we go. All right. So up there. Let's go at them as waypoints. Since we don't know what's there. Uh, free text. This was... Uh, West Village? West Village. West... Village. I've set my uh, mic to Vox. If it's a bit hot or you keep hearing background stuff, just let me know. No worries. I'm probably going to do the same here in just a minute. Uh, let's see. Romeo Bravo Quebec 8999. 9371. Should we start flying north? Uh, route. Yeah, I'll, I'll drop waypoint one in there. Give me, uh, give me one second. Waypoint one. I got the point, and I'm just building a route for you. Yeah, take take your time. Got be one more bad out like a farm coming up. Departure. All 
All right, you got direct waypoint one right now. Beautiful. I'll build a rest right now. I expect every time I look at something, I want you to go, slave, de-slave. Right. <laughs> and then right. randomly just go, can't see the target. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Point and I didn't. A point. I like that. This is uh, east. Village. That is Brown Quebec 9809 I know there are programs out there that I could use to make this a little bit easier. Um, I just don't have them. So I gotta do it the old fashioned fat finger way. Just fine. Did I put three? Apparently I put it not where it's supposed to be. All right. Uh, guess I need to fix that. Uh, Commando, thanks for the follow. Awesome. I appreciate it. Welcome to the stream. John Bloor and I are doing some Apache flying, and we've got uh, Tidy Tibbs, who is uh, coming along with us as uh, the second of our two ship. Let's see. There's got to be a way to delete these. I just don't remember. Where are we flying? We are in Gray Flag, Persian Gulf. All right. Let me do this. I'm just going to... Yeah. it's See, it's not that far. I screwed up a grid or something. That's okay. We'll enter in a new point. I know I can delete a point out of the route. Or I can at least... Uh, Okay, 
four zero Romeo. Oh, that's the problem. I didn't change. It's not Bravo Quebec, it's Charlie Quebec. That makes a difference. Zero nine two two nine three two Front of waypoint three. And now one, two, four. Perfect. All right. All right, we are thirty six clicks out. Alright, um, I think we got all the points in. Beautiful. Now the, um, the points are actual center mass of the, uh, the red circles, so don't get too close. Yeah, that's fine. Um, this is the, yeah, this is the yeah, gray the, flag. Um, the show, brat show, and you go viz to own, you can put the rings on and it gives you a nice little eight kilometer ring around your helicopter, so you can kind of use that to judge how far I am from stuff. I'm sorry, say that again? So, on the TSD, yeah. you go to show, then threat show, and then on the top right it says threat. Viz threat. If you hit that again, this is Viz own. And then on the bottom right, OSB, so that's uh, R6, it's one of the rings. If you box that, it's an 8 kilometer ring around your helicopter. It's quite useful. Uh, okay. Rough, rough direction and stuff. You're like, don't, don't tell me what I already know. <laughs> no, I, I honestly, I don't recall that function, so that may have come after I stopped flying. I don't know. Uh, I have not messed with it that much, so. Cool. Yeah, especially George. He's like, he refuses to fire 8,001 meters. He's like, nope. So you're like, ah, okay. Now, I gotta say that, uh, you know, I haven't done any front seat work in a while. I just got the controls set back up and uh I did a little bit of practice with them but uh but not a lot. Is this like when the girl's like, You're the first guy I've brought back here and then the dog gives you like a suspicious look and you're like, Alright <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's see here. I'm flying in the back of the Apache and I've got a, a dude who did it for real life and he's in the front going, I'm just a little bit nervous, so, you know, <laughs> if I don't get things right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Look, I've flown this in for real with DCS, that so obviously means I know how to do it in real life, right? <laughs> I was wondering if these scrolled. Usually it gives you the... Uh, this. But. Oh yeah, the gain. Yeah, the flared things. I think I bound those to like... Up and down, left and right on my keyboard or something. Just somewhere easy. Because you can't see have to fuck around that thing. Is there an... It, uh, yeah, tell me, I don't know if it's real life or not. Did that thing not have like an auto gain function or something? It does. Um, that's the uh, the ACM. Mm -hmm. It. I don't. 
think I don't know if they've modeled that or, or not, but it's yeah. supposed it's auto contrast. It's mm-hmm. not really a, a, a auto gain like you um, you have to manually adjust the, the gain and level every every time. Yeah. Every flight, and then you're constantly adjusting it as you get more, you know, acclimated, or the temperature starts changing, or whatever. Um, gotcha. The uh, the ACM w- would kind of help some of that. Sometimes it it wasn't the best. Most yeah. people most people didn't use it at all. Is it like? Is it like the Microsoft Clippy of the Apache? It's just like, just turn, first thing you do, you just go and just turn it off. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> I've always noticed that as a general, like, thread. It's like whenever, like, especially in military aircraft, they add, like, some automated thing. If it isn't amazing, it's always the case where the pilot's like, yeah, we just switched it off. It was kind of shit. <laughs> Yeah, there, there's, yeah. A lot of stuff like that. Yeah. Alright, so I've frozen my uh, view so that it doesn't keep falling my head. Because really, this is what my focus is, right? Since we're, we're flying front seat... You know, I'll do a little bit of looking outside once in a while, but, uh, you know, since we're going to kill bad guys, my focus is out front. So if we kind of look over here, I'll tell you what, let's unlock it. If we look over here, um, you can see waypoint one is... Bro, like, um, as far as, like, waypoints and stuff, assume you just do that on, like, a computer and load it into a DTC, right? Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Either that or, you know, it, let's say your computer's all shit the bed, you know, you'd have one guy go out and do it and then he blasts them out to everybody else over the net. Yeah. Um, so, waypoint one is that city, it's in the valley, there's a river, so lots of places for these guys to hide, but at least we're a little bit familiar with Do you ever send offensive messages through the net? Who, me? No, never. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it happened. It happened. Uh, I won't say it never happened. It, it definitely happened. But it, it wasn't, you know, like like if you were practicing a mission or something like that, obviously you didn't, didn't do it then. But, you know, if you're just yeah. flying around, screwing around, and, you know, one of your company aircraft is out there, you know, Send him a nasty gram or something. <laughs> hey, jackass, what, what are you guys doing? <laughs> uh, Alright. Let's see here. That's a ridge line. On the... So it's peak over. looking outside right now. Okay, yeah. I see where we are. See if I can get some look down into this uh, this valley here. I'm slowing it down a little bit so we don't get a whoa boy. Sounds good. I also keep thinking, oh, this is the ridge line. Oh, no, it's the next one. Oh, this is the ridge line. Oh, here you go. You got a little bit of a view in there. All right, looks like I got some troops in the open. Okay. They don't look friendly. Nope. Range on them. Not arm the aircraft. Thighs of steel. You sit down like that for that long. And it's burning. Right, let's see here. I'm gonna 
plug-in anyway, sir. Because it's not on. Apparently you have to turn the laser on. All right, 9,200 meters where those troops are. Copy. I'm going to laze and store. Copy. Okay, I'll, let, me, let me try that again. I'm going to laze and try to store. All right, target 09. Let me back out. Truck moving around. What's this guy? Oh, nothing there. Alright, so far all I'm seeing are those troops and that truck. Roger. Do you want to gun them? Yeah, I think that, uh, that'd be good. Oh, okay. it's all full somebody's shooting at us. Is that at us? Well, let me rephrase. Somebody's shooting. I see a, a helo. Yeah. Oh, it's two. Oh, okay. <laughs> I love how we're like behind this hill and just peek over and see what we see and just two guys are just like yeah. Leroy! I'm gonna guess <laughs> oh yeah he's shooting at us or hold on hold on no 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 he's he's engaging ground targets okay yeah he's shooting at those guys on the ground right okay, okay. So, so we don't need to be sneaky breaky anymore okay roger nope Oh man, I was holding a nice hover for you. Then, that was you good, know, man. Then you have a look in, you know, mask into the right, mask into the left. Like being all sneaky breaky. And then just two guys, Leroy, straight in. Yeah, right. <laughs> well, hopefully those hinds are doing something useful and like carrying some troops too. Yeah, roger that. They can drop them. Capture it. Right. We'll do a little orbit if you fancy it, see what we see. Yeah, that'll work. Yeah, if you hold about this distance from the city, I'm showing it about six and a half clicks. That, that's perfect. Copy. Right hand orbit? Yeah, that'll work. Do you need a good altitude? Would be higher, lower? Um. No, this altitude will, this altitude will work. That's fine. Roger. Are those hinds still around, or do they bail out? Let me have a look. Got an Apache and a hind, yep. Oh, okay.
So far, all I'm seeing are like civilian cars. Hmm. Should do a quick last check. So this is something in there. Few. See the hind. What's he shooting at? He's shooting at something over here. Okay. He's landing, so hopefully that means he's mm -hmm. putting out some troops. Yeah, tally hind. I also right. felt very close to Tally Ho. So I felt, I felt the British <laughs> rising inside of me. Tally Hind! Roger. Those are friendly are troops. Yeah. Oh, they're shooting at something. Are they? They killed something. Yeah. Uh, keep going right, keep going right, keep going right. There's a burning car they just shot at. Oh, interesting. We'll do a close hand orbit. So you can look right in. It looks like they shot at something, but they hit a car. That's fine. I'm going to keep an eye out for tracers. I wouldn't normally overfly, but I feel like whatever it is, it's probably like a dude or a truck or something. Oh, something yeah. shooting at us. Hit. Yep. Where's that? Is that coming from where I'm looking? I don't see anything. Uh, I can't. I can't tell. Might be on our ass. Oh, it's yeah, coming, it's from, coming behind from behind us. us. Yep. Come around and back away a little bit. Oh God, yeah, yeah. Uh, so is dude. Yeah, there. Yeah, around there. One guy. Yeah, I'll get right. you in um, constraints. There you go. Should be good. He's down. Got him. I'll come round for another orbit. So I'm over flying here. This is really not a good idea. It's all good. I'm just I'm taking a look while we're overhead. I may as well zoom out and look around. Okay, these are the friendlies, right? Yeah, there you go. West Village captured by Blue Four. Okay, good deal. We're good. I'll do another last check as well, we'll just see if this one has any stuff. Yeah, this so this has few and East MSR has more than a few, so. Okay. I'll give you a direct waypoint too. Not that you can't see exactly where we're going, but Yeah. Well it's useful, it's giving me distance and stuff, isn't it, right? Yep. I'm 
follow this uh, riverbed just up on up our nose. I'll go along this way and kind of give you a good okay. slant angle to look in. Say about this height, we're about 640, 650 uh, feet. That works. Cool. A little high, but obviously just to peek into some of these uh, alleyways and stuff. Yeah. I don't anticipate significant air to air, so not oh, worried exactly. about the. Uh, or, or Sam fire, so not worried about the uh, altitude. <laughs> the moment you say that, we just get SA 15. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> Son of a. Tracking. Yeah. Launch, launch. Or you just see a smoke trail. Damn it. I'm both enthralled and disturbed by the fact that the Kiowa has the speak and spell APR 39 <laughs> and I'm not sure if I'm going to love it or hate it every five seconds hearing power signal drop power signal drop big well, wing searching oh I see some fire ground fire oh holy shit yeah 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. go defensive I'm going to back off alright I think I got it lazed and stored I roughly saw where it was. It was on the kind of the other side of the, uh, uh, what do you call it, town. If I was to picture it on the map, it felt, it felt like it was sort of like southwestish of the town, southeast. Sorry, southeast of the town. So he was shooting at us, huh? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Alright. Let's do this. Let's see. Alright, nose on. So forward left, that is friendly. Friendly as well. Something is in there smoking, so... What is this? Uh, let's see if I can grab it. I'll settle in so you're not fighting the earth uh, as much. Ah, no worries. I'm with the LMC on now. That's helpful. just happened with my trim. Come on now. There you go. That's better. <sighs> Not sure. That was a, a big hot spot, but it doesn't look like there's anything there. So. And everything else appears to be smoking. Hmm. They might have hit what shot at us. Maybe they swung it. There's a truck there. Bravo. There's a truck on the road, there he is, left of the road, next to the tree. Uh, I don't know if where you see the burning vehicle. Go up in here. Uh, come right. Right. Yeah, you can come right. He's kind of behind the tree now, there you go, and then go left. Go left of that, that straight left of that burning vehicle, he's kind of behind the tree now. Can you see him? It's a truck, left of the road. Uh, Coming up, coming up, he's just behind, yeah, you're literally on him now, there you go. On the left. There you go, him, yeah. I'm getting glare, is that a technical? Yeah. It's a, tr it's a truck of some sort, hang on, I'll, I'll slide right, see, see past that tree. Something in there. Okay, yeah, it's there a truck. Go. Like a Ural or something. Alright. Hundred. Yeah, he's sure. gun range. Oh, holy shit! Rockets going off. Oof. All right, he's dead. Take that, Gorbachev. There you go. <laughs> Gorbachev. <laughs> 
people watching the stream are like, who? <laughs> the guy with the, the, the bird poo on his head. Oh, that guy. Does it Gorbachev look like he's got a bird and pooed on his head? It was like, yeah. a, it was like a gun thing, wasn't it? Yeah, Does giant, he run off and rub giant it off birthmark. And I knew it. Yeah. Frank Drebin rubs it off, doesn't he? With a handkerchief. He goes, I knew it. <laughs> Frank Drebin. <laughs> There's another one. People are like, who? <laughs> yeah, exactly. These guys are all dead. Oof, too fast. seeing anything else. Mm. So I don't have George eyes, so... Yeah. Let me just get it into a hover hold and I'll just do a quick last check. Yep, zilch on this one. Okay. it up there I think yeah, yeah. we may have some uh, harder targets to play with here oh hello yeah oh, hello. Like a couple uh, of BMPs it's our range 91 9,000 I'll get, get a little closer. We can push to about seven or six ish. That'll work. You know, they modeled the, uh, the reflections. And while I can appreciate it, <laughs> I don't enjoy <laughs> dealing with it. <laughs> yeah, exactly right. I said in the Kiowa in the Kiowa Discord. I don't know if they appreciated me saying this, but I was like, "Yeah, the speak and spell RWR is cool. Maybe in the special options, just as a backup, maybe you should put like a nice normal bitching Betty in there that says the same things." Because I can see some people going, "Nope." <laughs> yeah. See Radar searching. <laughs> All right, I think this range is good. Alright. Alright, you're free to fire, just gonna stable up. Good to go. Alrighty. We are in constraints. Crumpet 1-1, Lattice Bravo, rifle. If I can 
Let this, uh... LMC here. This thing is a pain. Mm. There's one. Shack. I think this is a tank. It's kind of hard. I can't tell. It's kind of stuck behind something. Oh, I'll slide left. I'm going to go for the target behind it anyway, so. The other yeah, BMP. Cool. It's a good BMP. Yeah, Roger. Here goes. Copy, 1-1 one, one rifle BMP, lunch Bravo. God, this glare is ridiculous. Is that Estrella? Strella? There's like a ZSU and a Strella. Yeah, I'm not sure. Oh, no, Shit. that's a Sam of some sort. Yeah, I just saw him go whoop. So, what do you want to shoot And Should we slide left, shoot the tank, and then we'll slide right and shoot these two vehicles? Right, sure. Sam. Cool. No, he's I'm taking sliding, out the, I'm uh, sliding the left. Sam. Give you, give you a clearer shot on that uh, T72. Rockets dotting the area. Right, stabilized. It's not on us. No, not on us. Alright, here we go. Loud Bravo, two times of IR missiles now. Got him or not? I don't think so. Uh, you killed the ZC. I think. Killed something. Alright. Can you IAT him? I, I'm trying to remember where I freaking mapped that. Sorry, right. take your time. Alright, that obviously wasn't it. I think you did a laser search. I think so. You're slave to me at the moment. Yeah, that's laser search, just doing a pattern. <laughs> just doing some snakes and ladders yeah. shit. Yeah. Uh, there. Alright, now. Me again. That's right. Slaved. That's store. There's IT. Okay. It's just Sorry. hard to remember where I map all this shit to. And I don't it's have the, the, uh, the thing, diagram it, in front of me, so. Right, police, Dude, I remember the days when you had those keyboard overlays. You could kind of, that little piece of cardboard and go around your uh, keyboard. Remember those? Where you'd put it behind yep. your keyboard. Yep. Alright, looks like he got that tank. Oh, so. shit, something just hit us. Just lost her tail. Whoa. Yep. I have no idea what just hit us. Uh, I 
gonna try and see if I can get this down. Oh, oh we're alive. Back. <laughs> my back. Oh, my back. <laughs> we're gonna need a lumbar support pillow off that one. Oh, man. Quickly, zero eyes. Zero eyes. What's zero eyes, but. The big red one right here. Oh, yeah. Done. I think that caught me this. You can't get our data. Someone needs to change that to the NordVPN button. I'm out. I'm getting out as well. <laughs> you don't. I can't get out. Oh, I got open the door first. Thank you. Thank you. Let, me, let me get my gun here. I don't think it'll be a cool mini game, wouldn't it? <laughs> now, see, that would be all right. You turn into a, a, a crunchy. <laughs> Look at me like that. <laughs> uh, hold on, Let's see. There we go. I can turn my body. Quick, let's run this way. Oh wait, no, not that way. Did I run into you? What's going on here? Man, we still had a lot of missiles. Yeah, we lost our tail completely. Slot back in and try it again. Let's see. Okay. I got some time still. I got uh I got about another hour left. And then I gotta go pick up the kids from school, so they are doing after school clubs today. Which is nice, cause uh is now a slideshow. Your uh, DCS? Huh. You know, I'm saying... Hey. There you are. Took me a minute. Well, I was having that? some issues slotting in. Or not sliding in. Uh, earlier, the screen was jumping. It was weird. Huh. Tidy Tiv hmm. said that when uh, when we got hit, he started lagging. Do you think we de we like desynced? I you know, there may have been a couple of points where it was doing a little bit of desync, but I don't think we completely desynced. I don't know. Because. Why did our why did our tail get blown off when the only vehicles enemy units were off front? Yeah, good question. I don't know. Maybe we desync so hard it just ripped the helicopter apart. I've seen it happen. Oh really? <laughs> yeah, hundred percent. Yeah, it happens mm -hmm. in the F in the F-15. If you desync bad and bad enough, it just rips the wings off. Because what it thinks it can't it can't like resolve the fact that your separate feet, the pilots like behind, the pilots in front. Huh. And so it goes, uh, and just rips the plane apart. Yeah. <laughs> Which is hilarious when right, you think one. about it. <laughs> Terrifying as well. Yeah. I don't know what's going on here, so we're just going to explode everything. Yeah. All right. Um, how do you do that lattice check? I don't know if they've updated it yet so the co-pilot can do it, but if you were to do it, you select the little mark label and 
top uh, bar when you're in F10, it's like the third one along. Uh, you bung it in the general direction area, and then you just type in like update B or update C, whatever latest you're on, and it will give you a little. In the, the um, right. in the game chat. So what you do, um, you create a, a little mark point on the okay. map. So if you look, yeah, you drop it somewhere, uh, okay. like, and then type in the little mark point. Is there a cloud coverage over the target? Okay. So I'll do it again. Yeah, update. I believe minimal. But if it um. It, sometimes I think some aircraft the co-pilot yeah, can do, and some of them can't. On the okay. Interesting. I'm gonna turn UHF down because it's really fucking loud. Oh, They're very chatty on there. I turned them all down. <laughs> yeah. All right. So I'm not My... gonna worry about the first two points. I'll just enter in a point for the uh, east end. So. Of course. I put a point down on the map, getting SA5. My favorite ever thing on DCS is when you get someone coming in and it's like DCS, but they're like, this, this is Tango Quebec 1 2 heading into the AO with 16 Hellfires and uh, 3,000 pads of fuel. <laughs> like, okay, dude. <laughs> and then there's someone else flying on the same lattice, like, like, Focus the radar dishes. Some guys are hardcore. Currently distracting him. I, I, I appreciate the passion. Alright, that point is in. That'll be waypoint one. Once the map comes up, we'll have a direct right to. Sweet. I'll get some Hellfires on the outboards. Okay. Uh, keep the fuel up, we don't need as many gun rounds. 50% gun. 40% fuel. I'm not going to launch right now, but I'm going to wait to get a little closer. Uh, a from SA5 is currently locking me up. Never mind. Uh, rearming. First, uh, dish. Run 35, defending SA5. Last Charlie. Oh man, I know, right? In the back seat, it's not so bad, in the front seat, it's ridiculous. I've still got the three uh, J cell on me, but uh, let's see how this goes for the first part. I'm coming up. Cockpit 1 1, bad on leg 8 coming up, departure to the north. Where is this? 
just a little ways. 31 miles. That's not bad. 17 minutes. Oh, eh, yeah. I'll try and get a bit more uh, speed in. I'll climb over these mountains as well, which is always fun. There's an SA dam there. Oh, yeah, we gotta go over top, don't we? Yeah. <coughs> Did the server crash just like reinstall all the SAM sites? Sites fired on me seconds ago. Nicholas, I'm just hold does its job. Can't rely on pilot AI. Yeah, I, so I was messing around last night and uh, I was trying to fly from the front seat. Actually, I was trying to have George fly from the back seat. Nope. <laughs> 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 Yeah, in fairness, we were heavy. I ate 16 Hellfires on board, but still, it's a pain. Zoom your view so the reticle's larger. I got a course of the SA-10. Yeah. I just fired on three of this, this dish and control center, but one more oh, thing. I did set that up. I couldn't remember if I set it up or not. Look at that. It is set up. I can... Ooh. All right. I forgot I had that mapped. I'll lock that up again. Oh. Yeah, I, I, I think this is, uh, it's all right, but I don't know. It makes my neck hurt <laughs> with track IR. I don't know. Seems like I was, uh, I do much better in VR. I'm actually I was you know, uh, doing full motion before I joined you. Uh, someone has modded the um, uh, JF17, so the RWR just says Matt Damon over and over. As you get locked, it just gets higher in pitch. It goes Matt Damon. <laughs> That's incredible. She's annoying. 103 Ash committing bandit group. Pulse 339 for 49 angels 8. Turn it down a little bit. Yeah, they have uh, the season sparring on my JSOs. Yeah, like I can't, I can't turn the intercom up any louder, but. Okay, I've, I've got cords on that. It's it then. She's on RWLR. Oh yeah, no, I, I've got her turned down. It's just yeah. the intercom is as loud as it can get. Am I am I a bit quiet? Am I? Yeah, but so is everybody else on the radio. So if uh, everything okay. is if everything is the if everything is set the same. Yeah. Going backwards? Oh god, did it start going backwards? <laughs> oh god, that's that decent. I bet it did that earlier and it ripped us apart. Maybe. It looked like we were going backwards for a second. It's, it's, yeah, back. it's just desyncing. Thanks, TCS. <laughs> what a piece of shit. This this game, right? It's it, it's it's both. Every so often, I'm like, holy shit, this is incredible, right? Like, yeah. I, I was saying to Cosmo earlier, right? I I booted up 
the old Jane's Longbow 2. I did yeah. boot up. I watched someone play it on YouTube, and I, as much as it's awesome and it still is, you're like, holy shit, this is so much better now. You know I mean, in your head, you're like, wow, oh, yeah. this is incredible. But also, you're like, oh, this looks amazing. I'm looking around the cockpit. There's all dinks, the scrap. You can see the primer underneath the paint and certain bits, like yellow primer. Yeah. And it's like, wow, the buttons have got little smudges on it. It's great. And then, and then you look at a ground unit, and he's sliding around like it's Home Alone. He's made out about eight pixels. <laughs> and he's just like, oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. Jeez. It's how I feel. Do you know when people thing. are like, it's done it again. Uh. Could be the servers doing a shit. Maybe it's not necessarily desync, but it's uh, it's just like lagging. One, two, three, two, yeah, some lag spikes. Five. Oh, it's a tad slave to me. I was like, why is that following me? Yeah. That's how I always feel about, like, do you know when you see, like, people like, AI is going to change the world. It's going to be so advanced. And then you just see the bots on Twitter, like, Pussy and Bio. <laughs> You're like, it's not going to take over the world. Zooms in pretty good. I'm just checking out the zoom function. Yeah. Got it mapped to the slider on my uh, Hotas. Yeah, yeah I, I don't. I I I, I don't sorry. mess with 2D no. very much, so. Mm. It massively helps, yeah, because because like. I, I've only used VR a couple Probably of times. Well, obviously, like real life, you kind of like focus on things with your eyes, like the natural yeah. way your eyes work. And, but using that that depth perception, even something something's farther away, you can kind of pick it out. But obviously, with 2D, you don't have that. So that's what that little like, that zoom in and out is super useful in it. So you can just have a quick little peek. I've also got like a snap view, so when I'm in the back and I'm flying in the back here, um, I've got like a snap view. If I push a button and hold it, it zooms in, like basically fills the screen with the uh, the MFD with the um, tads on. Oh, nice. So like I, I can have a quick like glance because in real life you can kind of again like if you had VR with peripheral vision, you could have a quick glance down, can you? But you can't really do that in track IR. You have to move your whole head. Right. This is not how it works. Right. Especially if you're like, John, there's something here, have a look. I'm like, look down, zoom in slowly, stabilize, <laughs> what, if it, what was that again? Yeah. Yeah. weird the um, the lag I don't know it just it, there there it was again it's just weird I wonder let's see do these work they work in the back yeah that's good because these don't actually slide in the front you have these these things they call them the bat wings these yeah, unfold yeah. and then it wraps up here Copy. around the top to shade this to keep the reflections off. But which would be okay if my video was down here, which it was yeah, when sure. you know before we had the uh, the TDAC and we, we had the old port. I put my video up here on the right side and then pull the shade up, and then you can see everything. And there's very little glare or reflection or anything. 
<laughs> By the way, also I love how people like pickle, pickle two times, target, target straight, and there's me a trick here, like I miss you. <laughs> Check up. <laughs> Are you still flying? Yeah, I'm still flying, yeah. Oh, man. If you could see my stream. Oh, no. Is it done the thing where it turns off? Go to outside view. Go to outside view. It's even better. F2, F2. <laughs> oh, no. D dude, we basically have to re-slot. It's Seriously? Completely broken. Yeah, it's completely broken. Well, yeah, it's can completely can easy. can you stay in and I just reslot? Try it. All right. Yeah, give that let's, a go. Jump out and I'll I'll get you back in. <laughs> Do you remember the first time we flew together? This is what <laughs> happened. I told you. I remember saying to you. Everything is working. It says the rotor brake is on, but okay. I'll, I'll cycle that super quickly. Ready? One, two, three. There you go. Okay, it's gone. <laughs> Dude, first time I ever flew with you, did that, and I was pissing myself. And you're like, I don't see it, and I was like, you're flying, and the rotors aren't moving. Oh, that's funny. And it. But it kept everything I had. Like, I was in day TV oh, and I had yeah, my acquisition source set to waypoint one. And it kept all that. Yeah. That's weird. DCS. It's almost fun. <laughs> <laughs> Is that a truck? I think that's a truck. Yeah, he looks, he looks burnt out and dead. Oh, I reckon. Yeah. yeah, you can see, like, the, uh, the skeleton of the uh, frame. Yeah. No, I think they, they were at a bridge, weren't they? Oh, hang on, save to me? Uh, stand by. What happened here? All your waypoints might be reset or something. George likes to fuck with all that stuff. Okay, yep. There you go. Looking at the bridge. Yeah, there was stuff around there. They oh, looks like destroyed. there's a. Is that Zisu still alive? In the middle of them? No, I don't think so. It's like a Z257 in the middle of it. Well, what happened? Dude, every every time I zoom in, it just freaking jumps. So on my screen, you're look. I swear, I'm looking at your screen on the stream. I'm looking uh -huh. at my screen. Oh, maybe you're. Maybe we're resynced now. Yeah, I think we're resynced now. I think. <laughs> Just jumped again. Uh, I don't know. It looks like. Oh man. Hold on. Sorry. That's hard to tell if he's dead or not. Man, this just this thing just keeps jumping. I don't understand what it is. I think it's slightly desync still. I think because it's looking right now. You're looking randomly towards a road. Okay, no, that's that's about right. What I'm seeing on your screen and my screen is the same. It's tricky to tell because there's like a lag, obviously, isn't there? Like, yeah, it I, keeps it keeps spiking. Yeah. So yeah, we'll go over this hill. We're about seven point five anyway. We'll get up to this hill. Settle out. <laughs> oh, 
Oh no, is it going back again? It's I just, saw, just. I looked over to your screen and I, I just saw it go. Whoop, whoop, yeah, it just really keeps quickly. jumping. I don't know. Oh let me let me God. try something. Let me just slave fix forward. I think we're desynced. We're three, one, six, two, yeah. Let me. Uh, Feel free to jump out and back in again. Yeah, I'm gonna try that one more time. Guess not. All right, be right back. Roger. <clears throat> Let's see. It's maddening. Let me in something. See what I can find. I think he's dead. Thought I, thought I hit that. All right. Uh, looks like everything's okay now. Yeah. Let's see. I think this guy's dead. He yeah, he's dead, isn't he? Yeah. He just looks a bit brighter than everyone else, isn't he? Right. Power up Mama attacking Kes Alanka from side from Bravo. seeing anybody. Hmm. Is that some guys there? You got another level zoom there. There you go. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Now yeah. well, what do we got here? Fifty seven hundred meters. Could park a hellfire in the middle of them. Sounds good to me. Just get you turned in a little bit. Okay. Check George didn't de-arm your laser or anything like that. Oh yeah, I got a big box set. Yeah, good. All right, here we go. That's a cool rifle. All right.
They look nice. Good. Yeah. Top right, hold all the points in the shaft for 215 more seconds. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm good. We'll pass on that one. <laughs> quit, 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 <laughs> quit criticizing my technique. <laughs> <laughs> Try my best. My wrist hurts. <laughs> <laughs> Don't appear to be picking anything else up. So Let me chuck a uh, should chuck a point down. Day B. Zilch. There you go. Yep. Okay. So we got a choice. We can go fly west, or we can fly east. We've got the QRF and supply to the east, or fly to the west, we've got Jenna Farp and all that lot. It's a bit of a flight, but it's a bit of a flight either way. Those QRF locations, are they usually... They can and they can't be, but we definitely know that Jenna Farp will have some stuff. Yeah. So maybe we head out that way. Yeah, let's go maybe west. Then. Why not? Yeah. East Factory. Yeah, I'll let Trick in there as well. Yeah, there's plenty of stuff over there. Let's head over there. Okay, cool. That works. I'll start heading west. Alright, let me build some points. I'll try it on 267. Copy 1-1, one, one, Journey fans 1-1. One, one. Alright, you gotta direct to uh, Jenna Farp. Beautiful. I'll start putting in the, uh, the other points here. I'll kind of fly along this corridor here where we're at at the moment. Yeah, that works. Just hope to fucking god we don't desync and rip the helicopter apart when we're like two minutes away. Only <laughs> napalm. Yeah. One, one, I'm showing if it, it looks like it's starting to get bad, I'll jump out again. Be careful. Yeah, yeah, Rog. What it will do is it will fly all this way. It's when we're like right near the area. We're like, right, we're getting right. set up. Get, get the missiles armed. Desync. <laughs> That one 
one's in. Next one. Town. You know, it'd probably be easier if I put it over here and did it. Then I don't have to keep going like this. Make everybody dizzy. What's the aircon like in this thing, IRL? Is it pretty good? Oh, it works great. The, uh, the A model would, uh, occasionally spit ice chunks at you if it got really humid out. Oh, wow. But, yeah, the, uh, the air conditioning works awesome. It's just, uh, they tell you when you start flying it. it it's not there for you. It's there for all the black boxes. You just get the benefit <laughs> from it. <laughs> We're just gonna remind you, you don't matter shit to us. Just make sure right. you fly it. Bring it back, alright? <laughs> yep. <coughs> um, I don't know why, but I just picture this, like, ha like grizzled old, like, general with, like, a, a, like a cigar for some reason. Just be like, just bring it back in one piece. Holy shit, dude. What's up? My girlfriend just came in. I shit you not. With cinnamon crumpets and a chocolate dip. Warm. Man. That's it, nice. dude, it's incredible. I know, it's incredible. I'm literally living up to my name. Crumpet one ones in the house. All right. Oh, bro, it's really good. Oh, yeah, it's yeah. cough noises and being They're groaning uncontrollably. It's just, it's just really nice food. Okay. <laughs> no one else. Yeah. So the the hat is my old battalion. Stand by. Alright, so the waypoints are in. Waypoint 2, where we're headed now, is the FARP. Waypoints 3, 4, and 5 are where the bad guys are. We could go direct to 3 if you'd like. Just panning over. Yeah, sure. Alright, I'll give you a direct. Waypoint three. Sweet. God damn. Yeah, so this is my, my old battalion that I commanded. Um, 2017, 2018, so. Um... 
you'd love this dude. Earlier on, the girlfriend yeah. was like, I'm just going to go out for a run. I was like, yeah, no worries. She's like, oh, what are you going to be up to? I was like, I'm just making garlic bread. <laughs> so it could be or two different things. <laughs> Yeah, the, uh, but the, the air conditioning in this, um, what they call it, they call it the ECS, the Environmental Cooling System. Yeah. Um, the mechanics actually had to get air conditioning certified to be able to work on it. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. At least back in the day they did. I don't know if that's still the case, but. Yeah. Well, i tell you what, that's certainly a skill for when you leave work. Yeah. Or leave the army. Definitely. Make a living out of that. I don't know how much of the certification, like, if they got... Like, obviously they didn't get full-blown HVAC mm. certification, but... It's got to count for something like that. Oh, yeah. Know? Yeah, yeah, I'm sure it went a long way towards... A full certification. I can imagine there's probably a point system, isn't there? If you go and get an actual qualification, where maybe even a couple modules or something, it counts for. Right. Was there ever a thing? Because you said you went. Was it you were in Black Hawks first, and then you went to Apaches, right? Was it the other way around? No, it was the other way around. I was Apaches first. Um, yeah. Then airplanes, and then Blackhawks for a very short period of time. Yeah. And, and was there a case of there's certain things that like can count towards the qualifications for other stuff? So they're like, okay, cool. We know you. You. We know you know how to do this. We know how to do that. Um. Maybe we just need to check you know it, but kind of. <sighs> Or do you have to go through the whole rigmarole again? Like, so, to qualify in the course, no, there's nothing really yeah. other than, you know, you can already fly a helicopter, but, yeah, you know, learning the nuances of the Black Hawk, like, when I went to, to that course, just, you know, learning those particular, what? Just a particular way that it blew. Yeah. Yeah. Um, like, when I got to the unit, I made pilot in command pretty quickly. So, mm -hmm. like when you when you finish the course, you are a... Basically, you're a co-pilot, right? And then... Sure. Um, you know, as you get experience in the aircraft, then eventually you become pilot in command, and aircraft commander, whatever, yeah. whatever you want to call it in the army. It's just pilot in command. Um, but then, uh, like for me, making pilot in command in the Black Hawk, number one, it's not, it's not, it, it's a, it's a different type of flying, and you're not so focused on the. Uh, you know, weapons deployment. Mm -hmm. So there's not a whole lot of systems that you got to learn. You just got to learn the mission and the, the planning. Blackhawks, the assault battalions, the planning process is just crazy. But yeah. Once you get through that, um, you know the flying, flying piece of it. Like, like I said, I made pilot in command pretty fast just because yeah. I had a lot of experience already. So yeah, um, that's really the only thing that that carried over say sure has there been anything in your commercial experience that you've gone holy shit I didn't I did end up using that like from military like something weirdly specific you go oh that's actually really useful that I know that or have you just found that like it's just general kind of skills again like in the uh, in the civilian world yeah, like, have you, have you had any weird little tasks or anything you've had to do, and you go, actually, 
I didn't think I'd use that again, and I've used that. Or is it just generally like, um, like you said, general experiences? No, not really. Yeah, just general experiences. Like, I'm flying big airplanes now, and you know, right. other than the air sense part of it, none mm. of it really translates. Other yeah. than the, you know, the airplane flying that I previously did, but it's even that it's a different kind of flying, you know, because I was flying small uh, business jets versus mm-hmm. now I'm in a seven sixty seven crossing the pond, you know. So yeah. Yeah, I do remember you. Yep. Um, no, it wasn't uh, C-21s. It was uh, uh, UC-35s. So, it's similar. C-21s... Yeah, I was curious about that kind of stuff, just because, like, I... At least in my job roles and what I've done, it's not as technical, for sure. I've definitely <laughs> got, oh, that skill that I learned in this completely different environment, weirdly enough, Kind of is applied again. I can kind of, it's like a soft skill, weirdly. I've gone, oh, I can, uh, just like that. And I always tend to wonder if there's little things like that within flying, where you go, oh, yeah, oh, actually, weirdly, I did that once. That actually really works for this. Yeah, not, not so much. Um, Mm -hmm. There's just, there's a lot of differences, you know, going from a a military business jet to uh, a commercial airliner, so. Yeah, it's uh, not 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 a lot of that transferred. Some of it does, but yeah, not uh, yeah, not, not anything you're not exactly unexpected. You're eating hellfires, are you from a uh... <laughs> right, right? From a uh, eight, yeah, seven three seven three hundred. But there's a triple seven passing below us. Rifle. Yeah. Chaffler, Chaffler. Uh, yeah. So C twenty one is a Learjet. Lear 21 and a uh, UC 35 is a Cessna Citation 5 series. Uh, so, similar aircraft. The Lear goes faster. Citation probably carries a little bit more. That's it. Uh, okay. You're over in Arif John now. Alright. power to you. <laughs> Better you than me. <laughs> Why switch from Hilo to Fixed Wing? Um, career propositions? That's, that's really... A flying helicopters is a whole lot of fun, but you need a shit ton of hours and uh, the jobs there, there's always somebody with a lot more hours than you, you know, somebody who's who flew helicopters in the army for 25 years as a line pilot you know that guy's going to go out and get the medevac job yeah, in the community because that's where he wants to live and, uh, and we're going to be shit out of luck so well, hello there, Mike. Um, and then hello, secondly is the pay Right. They, I think we're about 12 miles behind it, you. It's, it's getting scary. better because a lot of people are leaving the helicopter world to go to the airplane world because the airplane targets, world for the last, I don't know, since you know, 2021, I mean, so for the last two, two, three years, uh, mount, the airplane world yeah. has been hiring like gangbusters, and the pay has been going up significantly. Um, so, you know, I... I had a, a break where I was a straight... Oh, I was in the inactive reserve, actually. And I was trying to get to the airlines. And so I I bought all my airplane ratings. Like, I went the civilian route to get my airplane ratings. I already had my helicopter rating. Um, but I went the civilian route to get my airplane ratings. Got hired by a regional airline flying a twin turboprop. 50-passenger turboprop. Um, Dash 8. And then... Uh, Transition to a, a 50 passenger jet, uh, ERJ 145, after that. Um, and 
My first year at the regional airlines, I made nineteen thousand dollars. That was two thousand six. Um, so, you know, it, it's it, the pay really sucked. Now, a first year regional first officer makes a hundred. Now, you know, eighteen years later, nineteen thousand versus a hundred thousand. You know, inflation and all that. It's not as big of a gain as it sounds, but it's still a pretty significant gain. It's, it's at least double, right? So, it's a livable wage, right? 100000 bucks is a livable wage. Um, especially if you're young and single and you live somewhere cheap. Um, $19,000 was not a livable wage, not even in 2006. So, um, a lot of people started jumping ship and going to the airlines because, you know, then you look at long-term career potential earnings. You know, there are guys at my airline who are making close to, if not over, a million bucks a year. I'm not one of them, <laughs> but there are, a lot, there are a few guys who are making that much. Um, now, they're hustling to do it. They're picking up every premium trip they can. They're working, you know, 25 days a month. But they're doing it right whereas you know I don't I choose not to, to work that much and I don't make that much I, I probably won't ever make that much at this airline which is okay with me but um, you know the potential is there especially like you know the guy the junior guy in my class 26 years old like he'll be at the airline for 39 years if he wants to be and if his health holds up and all that um well, imagine the first year he's making a hundred, the second year he's making a hundred and fifty, the third year he's making two hundred. Um, okay, dude. Um, so, so I'm seeing some smoke off R12, but the bridge. Alrighty. I saw the lattice check. It looked. What do we got here? Ooh. This guy's smoking, but he doesn't look dead. Yeah, I think he's still alive. So range on him. Can you uh, arm us? Oh yeah, Roger. Armed. All right, thanks. Right at eighty, just in outside of eight thousand meters. Sure, do you want to hit him? All right, let's see if I can IAT him. Nope. Oh. Oh, beautiful. Center mass. Right, I'll call it. Copy it, 1 1, Lattice Alpha Rifle M60. I'll park us up on this little hill here. Good shack. Good shack. Is there a truck to the right of that, like, group we just saw down the road? Oh, he, that, uh, that's dead. Yeah, those look dead for sure. Okay. Sliding to the left. We got a nice little uh, pocket we can we can sit in right in front of us. Awesome. What I'll do, I'll come into this little area here, probably around here actually, because we're seven point five out, and I will um, I'll get a stabilizer and we'll pop up. That uh, works. Wait point three is off our nose. 
Got some heat signatures. They look... They are dead. Well, this guy may not be. He's still... Kind of elevated. Mm. His tracks look a bit fucked, though. Yeah, he may be... Let's see. Yeah, I can't... I can't lock on to him. Yeah, it's probably... Yeah, he's usually dead. It's DCS is on that is. Alright, still coming last. He looks dead too. Yeah, watch. Oh, they look very much alive. Yes, yep. they do. How are you doing for range? Uh, 7.4. It'll work. Cool. Yeah, it'll work. I'll call it. I think we had a little desync there. Oh, there you go. Alright, here we go. Just a second. That. What are you guys shooting at? Uh, we've got a uh, couple BMPs and APCs at the moment. Just took out an MBT up at North Alice Clear. Looks like most of the stuff's in the main area of Jenna. Uh, that's what I was afraid of. Roger that. Good, good check. Good shot. Oh, sweet, looks like a T seventy two. Oh no, BMP. I'll oh, slide left. Got a BMP and a BTR. Uh, sir, so I'm currently looking at you with the tads here. It looks like your tail hook is down. You might want to check that. Just a second one here, just a couple seconds. Watch that. <laughs> I love that there's a person in the chat called Player, and just in caps, he just went, Is there an auto start for the Hercules? <laughs> uh, what do you say? There's a guy in the chat, in, in the in-game chat, he's called Player, and he's in caps, he just went, Is there an also stuff for Hercules? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we got a truck out here. Let's uh, hold off on the truck, see if there's any... This guy smoking? Yeah, he is. Okay. Yeah, he's... Didn't look like he was in the flare. 
He did. He did. Have you seen the um the YouTube clip? Reporter goes ghetto in five seconds. Of what? Have you seen that one? Reporter goes ghetto in five seconds, and he's no. like, "What happened on that fateful Tuesday?" And a bird oh, yeah, yeah, goes yeah, in his yeah, mouth, yeah. and he goes, C -c -c "What the fuck is that?" Yeah. Shit flying in my mouth. All right. <laughs> Looks like another BMP here. Range is good. Ready. Check. Dread the line. Awesome. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. That is, uh, oh. appreciate the, uh, the support. Any boys seen an aircraft carrier around here? I have no idea. What just shot us? Team kill. <laughs> we just got shot the ship. By Tricker. Oh. Did we just get killed by Tricker? Yes. Says you have been team killed by Tricker. <laughs> oh man, that's awesome. Massive desync, huh? Interesting. Sorry, John. Sorry, Schoolio. <laughs> I don't know what happened. Oh man. We dead. No, I'm not dead. I can get out. Here. I'm out. It's all good. Hey John, I got to bail. I got to, uh, got to go pick up the kids here in a little bit. So <laughs> that's, that's fine. I, I just trying to figure out what the fuck just happened. I just went to the chicken street. <laughs> I was like, did you just shoot us? <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, we crashed into him, but like he's fine. You were in a hover. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Man. <laughs> yeah, man. Enjoyed it. It was a good time. Goddamn tricker, man. <laughs> yeah, we'll do it again soon. Yeah, no worries, man. Take it easy. Yeah, thanks for flying with me. Alrighty. Well, thanks everybody for uh, for joining in. As I said, I gotta I gotta head out. It was a good stream, though. I appreciate everybody dropping by. All the likes, follows, support. It's awesome. Uh, trying to do this more and more so I am off for another 
five-ish days, I think, for my next trip. So probably won't stream on the weekend, but uh, I'm going to try to be on. My wife's home tomorrow. We'll see. I'm going to try. No promises, but Monday for sure. So anyway, thanks, everybody. I appreciate the support. We'll see you next time. Peace.